Hi all. Topic for today's session is data discovery with the ClickSense. With a data discovery tool like ClickSense, we can explore data to see what's happening and why. Navigate vast amount of data from the multiple data sources, ask questions and find answers. With a data visualization tool, we can create smart personalized interactive data visualizations, reports and dashboard. With the ClickSense, we can build rich interactive visuals to show the story in the data, easily upload the data and then drag and drop for our analysis, get more answer as quick as click with fast, and translate data with the visuals. For today's demo, we are exploring and discovering Oracle purchasing, only purchase order, data with the ClickSense. To begin with, we have created a dashboard to explore purchasing KPIs, PO analysis, and on-hand quantity. On the purchasing, on purchasing KPI page, we have focused on purchasing trends. We have bar chart to display the purchasing trend by supplier to see who is our largest supplier. Then we have donut chart to show purchasing trend for items, what items we are buying frequently. We have a pivot table on the right hand side to show the complete picture of purchasing yearly with the option to expand supplier and see the yearly data. We have a line chart at the bottom to show yearly purchasing trend. And as you can see, how our purchasing spikes in the year 2006, 7 and 8 and hit rock bottom in 2014, 15 and 16. On the left hand side, we have a data filter for the supplier and sites and year and supplier. In the second page, we, we are displaying the purchasing analysis. On the left hand side, we have a various filter for organization, inventory org, PO status, supplier and sites, items. This filter will help us to narrow down our search very specific to a status, item, supplier, site, or, or, or an org. At the top, we have a KPIs to show number of POs, number of approved suppliers, total quantity purchased, total quantity received, total quantity invoiced. In the center, we have a bar chart to show top 20 supplier along with the amount, top 10 items. In the bottom, we have a data table to show data specific to a purchase order, purchase order line, quantity, item, descriptions. In the next page, we continue with our purchasing trend. And as you can see in this page, Again, on the left hand side, we have a filter for supplier and sites and dates. At the top, we have a line chart to show the yearly sale. And at the bottom, we have a chart, line chart to show the quarterly sale. The next page is for the on hand quantity, where we can show the on hand quantity for the warehouse. Let me jump to the real demo. As you can see in our KPI page, we have a bar chart, we have a donor chart, we have a line chart, we have a pivot table, and then we have a filters. With the pivot chart, I can explore data for a supplier, a particular supplier. As you can see, as uh, I selected the advanced network devices and the complete, complete dashboard refresh automatically to show the data for one supplier. I can pick years. Since I have not selected any supplier, so system, uh, the dashboard is refreshed to show the data for 2016 for all the supplier. I have an option to select multiple years and complete dashboard refresh automatically. Similarly, I have, a, I have an option to pick any number of suppliers and complete dashboard refresh automatically show the data as per my selection. I can select one supplier, multiple supplier. Similarly, with the help of a donor chart, I can do the analysis for, for, for a particular item. Let me remove the filter and switch to next page. In the purchasing analysis page, we, we can see our PO count, supplier count, item shipped, invoiced. Suppose I want to expand data for a few suppliers. So I have an option to see the data for one supplier or multiple supplier at a time. And a complete dashboard will refresh automatically 
I can see the data for the PU status. I can see the data for the operating unit and the complete dashboard refresh automatically. Let me re remove the filter and move to the next page. In this page, we have a purchasing, yearly purchasing and quarterly purchasing. Uh, here you can see uh, the purchasing trend supplier wise. Let me explore 2000 data for 2007. As you can see how our uh, purchasing was at the peak in the month of January and then hit the rock bottom in July and start picking again. Let me clear the filter. And uh, if I want to see the data for a particular supplier, I can see for one supplier, multiple supplier at a time. And the complete dashboard refresh automatically. Let me clear the filter and switch to the next page. In the next page, we are displaying the on-hand quantity for warehouse. If you guys uh, like to see this demo, feel free to reach us at inquiry at businesssite.com. And if you are interested in building dashboard on structure, on structure data, uh, we can help you to build the dashboard. We have expertise in technology like ClickSense, Oracle Indica, Tableau. So feel free to reach us and we can help you to create the dashboard. Hope you like this demo. Thank you very much.